Yo, was young child. Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to a brand new banger video. Fresh out the shower if you know, you know. Anyways, this video is going to be showing you how to do that insane spiral text effect. And before we get into it, if you can just drop a like and subscribe to the channel with post notifications on, that'd be highly appreciated. Thank you so much. Anyways, let's get straight into it. So guys, the first thing you want to go ahead and do is just go to the Google Drive link in the description and download the After Effects project file, which is going to allow you to add whatever text you want. You want to go ahead and edit this to your liking, so use whatever font you want, whatever text you want. I would recommend doing something related to the song you're using. But yeah, just type in whatever you want. Now what you want to go ahead and do is double click on the text layer and that's going to highlight everything. Then I'm just going to put text as an example. Uh, you want to basically fill the circle around one third to two thirds. Just You don't, basically don't want to fill up the whole circle. So around half or a third or two thirds is good depending on how long the word you're using is. But something along the lines of this is good as long as you don't fill up the whole circle. Then you can go ahead, change the font, do whatever you want. And then you just want to go to file, export and add to render queue. Then you want to go ahead and double click on uh, this right here and choose RGB and Alpha, hit OK and then just click render and that's going to render and then we can import that into Sony Vegas. Okay guys, so now that you've gone ahead and imported your After Effects clip, which is going to be the text into Sony Vegas, you now want to go ahead and just sync up whatever clip you're using and the song on the beat drop and press M to create a marker. Then from this marker you want to go minus 50 frames back and you want to go ahead and split the clip. Here we're going to be applying my preset which is going to be also in the Google Drive. It's going to be called the Tarot Orange Build Up if I can find it. Uh, yes, there's quite a lot of presets here and if you do want all of them, then make sure to go ahead and check out my editing pack. Here it is, Tarot Orange Build Up, 50 frames to the left. Go ahead and apply that. You're going to need quite a few plugins for this one, but don't worry, the Magic Bullet Looks, the new version is going to be in the Google Drive as well, which is quite hard to get, but if you use that Google Drive, it's going to be super easy and take about two minutes. So yeah, that's going to be in there for you guys as well. As you can see, it's applied everything. Now, one thing you can actually do is change the color. So you don't have to go for an orange, which is what it's default on. You just want to go ahead and click edit look and go to the hue saturation and just mess around with this. And as you can see, you can change it to legit whatever color you want, which looks so, so nice. Then just click the tick and you're done. Okay, so now to actually use the text itself, what you want to go ahead and do is just add the clip that you got from After Effects. And we're basically going to find the area where the text begins to disintegrate. So as you can see right here, it's starting to fade out a little bit. Around this sort of region, you just want to split the clip, delete that, and then go to the main marker here. Move uh, this across to the left quite a bit and begin to fade it in. So don't go past where the build-up starts because then the text will be there for too long and it won't be properly synced to the song itself or whatever you're using. So yeah, just make sure you do it around that region. Go one to the right of the marker, split the clip, and then you can go ahead and fade this in by just a few frames from left to right. Then from here, we're gonna go ahead and apply the second preset. Now you will need to adjust a few things here because each clip is different and the text is gonna be different for each, but it's gonna be go ahead and called the Tarot Circle Lyric uh, Text Effect. That is gonna be in the Google Drive as well, so you can go ahead and download that there. It should be, all the presets should be one folder so you can download them all at once. Then, as you can see, you're going to have your text right here. So now that you've gone ahead and applied your preset, the final thing you need to go ahead and do is basically add your pan and crop. So around the middle where you really want the text to be perfectly surrounded around the character, uh, you want to go ahead and move this on pan and crop just so it goes around the character like so. And basically you want to go ahead and go to position and delete the first keyframe and move that across there. And as you can see, your text effect is now going to wrap perfectly around your character across the clip and it's going to fade out just like that right there. Now that's the main part done. One really, really nice thing that I think basically makes this effect look so good. Again, I do use it quite a lot. It's just a few overlays and this particles one is specifically really, really good. You just want to make a new video layer and uh, go to the compositing mode and screen it just like this and then press screen, if I can move across that screen and you just want to fade this in and fade this out just like you did for the text and then what you can do is change the colour of these using HueSat Bright and basically this is really really good because you can match it exactly with the colour of your Magic Bullet Looks as you can see I can make it orange and that looks really really nice with the Magic Bullet Looks so yeah guys, that's the whole video there. I really hope you did enjoy this effect is appealing to you. If it is, please drop a like and subscribe to the channel with post notifications on. It really does mean a lot to me and I appreciate that so much. At 3000 supporters, I'm doing a free editing pack and I might possibly do it with another editor on another software. So if you would like to see that, use code Tarot in the item shop. And finally, if you want to take your editing to the next level with lots of presets just like these, 
make sure to go ahead and check out my editing pack link in the description super good price and it's going to make you an insane editor thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you in the next one boys peace